guys this is Kefren your favorite French Canadian so today I'm gonna talk about graphic card I will do a little guide because Black Friday is coming Christmas is coming and a lot of per people want to, to change their graphic card so I decided to compare AMD versus Nvidia uh, so here it is right now you can see um, all the different cards from AMD and Nvidia and uh, with price point, price point right now are in uh, Canadian dollars. So it's about the same ratio. If you're uh, from the state, it will be a less cheaper, a lot cheaper. Sorry. And uh, but for an example, if the 390 is more expensive, uh, it's less expensive in uh, Canada. It will be less expensive in the states too. So it's pretty much the same. But uh, Canada normally it's <laughs> it's a lot expensive to buy uh, computer stuff. So um, this is all the card that you can get all different segment different price point from AMD and Nvidia and um, that's about it we will go back to this um, to the this table after and I will do uh, a little like uh, for each category which one uh, I think is the best for your money and we will start with some benchmark so oops sorry <laughs> my other video <laughs> so okay uh for benchmark um we will use direct x12 because i think um if you buy a video card right now you don't want to buy a video card with all uh, architecture and all technology in it okay so you really want to buy a, a video card that will be compatible to direct x12 to be um to, to have the better performance because we saw and the previous in some benchmark in the first benchmark that uh uh age of the singularity uh when it went out uh nvidia had a lot of problem with direct x12 but now it seems to be a little bit uh they, they fix stuff so for an example this is the first benchmark i will show you guys so the 980 ti is uh first it's almost the same with the Furry X from AMD, but you can see a big difference between the 390 and the uh, GTX 9070 because uh, technically it's the same segment and AMD is a lot better in it. Uh, so right now I think for D DirectX 12, if you go uh, for a video card like IN video card, you should maybe think about the 980 for Ti, and if you want a mid-range, you should go to for, for for AMD. I did a lot of different research, and uh, I think AMD has like a good arch architecture right now for DirectX 12. But maybe next year Nvidia will have a uh, new uh, technology with Pascal, and it will be better. But right now, it's pretty much uh, it's a good benchmark to to see um, which one is the best. So this is another benchmark uh, for the Fury Rex and the 980 Ti. So again, little edge for uh, the 980, but um, that's almost the same thing. So this is uh, 1080p, and you can see 4K over here. Um, Fury, it's a little bit better, but uh, honestly, it's pretty much the same. Finally, uh, Fable. Pretty much the same thing. Uh, Fury X is a little bit better than the 900 Ti, but it's almost the same. Uh, you can see here, this is the, the worst part for NVIDIA. It's the 990 do better than the 980 from GTX. So this is not the same segment. Technically, this card should be versus this card, and that one versus that one. So uh, AMD did a very good job with the, those new cards. Uh, they're not just rebranding from the 290. They're like uh, they improve a lot of different thing in it uh, Efficiency power consumption and stuff. So it's a it's, it's a really good card. So this is some benchmark for the 4k So let's go back to all the segments. So for the first segment, uh, back in the days when you were spending $200 Canadian for a video car, you, you, you had like a pretty good car and you can run like Doom Tree at IA and stuff like that. But now with $200, you can do a lot, <laughs> a lot of stuff. For example, if you buy a R7 370 from AMD, you will have maybe 20 FPS uh, when you play at the Witcher 3 with, I don't know, iGraphic. So that's kind of 
bad. So uh, for the first segment, you should go with the uh, GTX 950. It's a little bit uh, expensive, more expensive than the AMD, but you got like better result uh, from it. Uh, the next one, uh, 960 versus the 380. It's pretty much the same thing. 960 do a little bit better in DirectX 11, depending on the game, but 380 will be a lot better for uh, DirectX 12. So you, my recommendation is the uh, 380. And you got like a, the new GCN from AMD, I think it's 1.2. Yeah, so you have all the new technologies in the card in the architecture, so it's a pretty good card. Here, in the third segment, no doubt about it, 390, and this is the card I think you should buy. Oh, sorry, if you have money, because um, I th I don't think it's worth spending like 869 dollar for a vi uh, video card. You just buy the the one at 400 dollar, and maybe in four years you just buy a new one at 400 dollar, and it will be the same. You will have this almost the same performance. So. Uh, yeah, so then 390, very good buy here. For sure, you should go with it. Next one, I will go to the 390X2. Uh, less expensive, do a lot better in DirectX 12. But in DirectX 11, the 980 is better. So it depends on what kind of video card you want. But if you find a 980 uh, less expensive than the 390 in the Black Friday, something like that, you can buy it. It's not like a bad buy should you go go for it after that you have the furry at 70 uh 739 uh don't buy this car you know nvidia doesn't have like a, a card versus that one it's pretty much random price point uh 290 is a little bit it's less powerful than the furry but uh, don't go with it it's not worth it for the price and finally the i hand card furry eggs versus the 900 ADTI, <sighs> that one is kind of difficult. If you buy a Furry X, it's okay. It's if you do Crossfire, it will scale good, and I'm pretty sure the Furry X will scale. Uh, will have a, a good scale with all the new driver for AMD for the next year. If you look at the 290X, uh, it improved a lot for the past two years, so I'm not worried about that. But I think Nvidia has uh, a small edge for the 980 Ti because. It's a lot better in DirectX 11, and they're almost the same at DirectX 12. So, and you got more RAM in it, but I know AMD is using the HBM um, memory on it, so it's supposed to be nine times more powerful than the memory from NVIDIA, but it's only four gigs, so I will go with the 980, and it, you, will, you will not be disappointed. At the price, it's almost the same for both cards, so that's about it. So... If you have any question guy you can comment to my video and ask me a question and i will tell you what is the best choice and so on what card you want to buy and yeah and if you can follow my channel i just opened that this channel in english i have another channel in french very popular in quebec so give me some love man ciao everybody